What is up, guys? DJ Independence here. It's been a while since I gave you guys an attribute update, so I figured I'd do that. Um, as you see, I am Rivet City, so I rock Rivet City course and everything. Just a side note. Uh, my tattoos, I just wanted to go over. As you see, I've worn the Oklahoma City Thunder logo. I got the uh, 303 on my stomach, the um, sleeve, and then this badass looking thing I just was scrolling through and found and thought, hell, why not? Anyways, let's get straight to the attributes. Uh, my jump shot is Rudy Gay, as you can see right here, Rudy Gay, it's on quick. Another jump shot I suggest you'd use is, mm, just scroll down, shot 51, I switch back and forth between Rudy Gay and shot 51, it's really consistent, and I have those both on quick if I didn't say so already. Uh, my free throw animation is Carmelo Anthony. It's a really quick pace free throw. Another one you guys should really try. It's really fast, really quick, easy. Is Steph Curry. Um, now my dunks, I keep it very simple, very generic. I don't know why the hell they're all the way up here or down below. Um, but anyways, as you see, I got the hangs off one. I try not to put on many dunks that will get blocked. Some of these can get blocked, but not very often. Quick drops off one. Uber athletic tomahawk off one. It's just there's multiple ways of doing these dunks. Like there's two or three different ways of doing it, and like the Uber, there's like one way that gets blocked, and then like the switcheroo gets blocked off of one way. That's the back scratch off one. But I, like I just said, I gave one of my dunks away, but it's alright. As you see, it's switcheroo. Like that one right there, that one gets blocked, but the other one doesn't. Um, basic 360, because I have a 78 driving dunk, which is gay. I can't do the historical Jordan. But anyway, this layup package has changed. It is now Jamal Crawford. That right there is super sexy. That right there, I'm working on the badge for that. I'm pretty sure that's like hop stepper. Um, I'm also working on Lob City Finisher. Just a bunch of uh, badges I haven't got yet that I should have got. Um, as you see, my contested is on normal. I keep that on normal. Dribble pull will probably always stay the same. It's Elite 11, most consistent, I feel like, in the game. Uh, my spin jumper is Steph, my hop jumper is Steph, my post fade is Jordan, it's the best fade in the game for shooting guards, point guards on such. Uh, my post hook, I don't know why, it's Shaquille O'Neal. Um, this kind of stuff I see not too many people change just because I, I test a bunch of them out and I just you know find the best one for me. As you can see, I use post shot 5, even though it, you know, it really shouldn't matter or anything. Uh, I use shimmy shot 2. Protect jumper three, and I use my dribble posture on low. Another one to try is default. I don't ever do my uh, dribble posture on high though; it's just it gets stolen really easy. As you can see, my ISO crossover is two. My behind the back and spin are both 14. They're the fastest in the game. Help you get where you need to be. And my hesitation. Now my hesitation is still the same. It's hesitation three, just because it's got that little snatch back or that little move right there you know it helps create space and I just I like it uh, my signature size up now my signature size up I don't see very many people use this but I like it it's simple quick behind uh, through the legs and then a crossover um, my inside out is Jamal Crawford another one um, I've seen people use that isn't too bad I just preferably don't like it is um, Jeff Teague, no, my phone, pardon me, uh, it, right there, probably catches a lot of ankles, I haven't caught any with it yet, because I barely use it, but, uh, my ISO cross is Kyrie Irving, I just started using that, but the one I was using that works very well is Chris Paul, a little move right there, and then my ISO escape is Isaiah Thomas, it's really effective, uh, a lot of people underestimate it I mean uh, everybody just I feel like rides off of the Kobe which you know oh it creates space and everything and then you can like go left or go right really fast well that you can do the exact same thing with the Isaiah Thomas it's actually even better but um, there's my animations and si signature styles um, now my attribute upgrades I did that last uh, nothing's really changing the badges or anything like I said I got one new badge and it was flashy passer 
But um, as you see now, I'm a 99 overall, not a 93, 95, whatever it was last time I showed you guys. But I finally have everything upgraded. Woohoo! Yay me! <laughs> you see, it still shows me it's a 2A star. But anyway, let's jump over to my new player that I have. <laughs> and as you see, we're back. Um, this is my new player, my power forward. Um, I was just gonna give you a quick update on my center. Basically, my center, if you don't know already, uh, I had like a power outage. I guess it since it spiked through my system, and I had to restart my whole si uh, system from scratch, like a brand new PlayStation. I uploaded shit from the um, storage, whatever online storage, and it, the last thing it's saved was me back in high school, which was weird because goddamn phone. Anyway, sorry, but um, the last thing it saved was me in high school, which is weird because I was about two. I was in my second season. Uh, I was. Ha about halfway, maybe a little past halfway, about three quarters away through my second season, which is really weird. You know, I put all the new games and everything. You think you would have saved and recognized it, but it didn't. So I'm still in 93. I still have 10 in the jump shot, you know, 16 in the defender and everything else with Max besides Playmaker. You know, I don't put anything in my Playmaker. But um, recently, uh, I had another outage and I was playing, which is fine, and everything was good. And then one day, it just turns on uh, as I register in my account and, you know dun dun pops up and everything and then it freezes and shuts off and it did that over and over and over and I didn't know what the hell I allowed it I waited a day or two and played on my other PlayStation and came back to this one nothing happened meanwhile I already played my center back into my second season and everything got back on the spurs and everything and then it get, did to me again reset me back to high school I didn't understand what the fuck you know, and I already messaged 2K the first time about it and everything. As you, they, you know, you go to their help website and it describes everything that happened to me, and says just email us this information and we can fix it. You know, of course they said, oh no, nope, we can't do nothing about it. And then you know, I created two small forwards and they stole 13,000 BC from me and they said, oh nope, sorry, can't do nothing about it. Which you know, which is bullshit. You know, you can do something about giving me VC back. But um, anyway. I just lately have been playing with him at the park and everything, helping grind and everything, and I just, I want to be able to shoot, you know, I just, I'm sick of being inside, and uh, this is the position I'm going to be making next year, he's going to be a balanced power forward, 6'11", you know, he's going to be able to shoot, but so far, um, I'm still in my first season, as you can see, I'm in my fifth game, I'm probably going to play that off tonight, but um, uh, this is right here in my stats. I was going to go 8 in the jumper and 7 in the defender, but I just feel like I need defender. Like, you know, I'm not a great defender, and I'm not a badass defender. I'm sort of below mediocre, if that's how you just want to round it up. So I do need the defense. I probably could have put all this into defender and then came back after I maxed that, but I would like some in my jump shooter. So, um, yeah, my inside and athlete and rebounder are maxed. It's an 88. But I, uh... I plan to be able to, you know, because last year is my first year making a big man. You know, I barely didn't know how to do anything but post and shoot. So that's always been a strong suit for me in the game. Um, so that's all I really do, or did. This year, I've learned a lot more, and I just, you know, try to change it up. But, you know, right now, in 2K17, I'm probably going to switch it up to where, like, I know everything, and I'm just not one-dimensional. But uh, other than that, that's all I got for you guys. Thanks for watching.